So what is going on everybody? Most of you guys probably saw my video where I talk about 16.1 being unacceptable. And I really wanted to talk more in depth about this holster that a lot of people are having trouble with. And we got a little bit of clarification that they are currently working on it. So let's dive into it. If you go right here, you might notice we have the new Picaro's holster, right? And if you notice, it has armor, crit chance, weapon damage. And what I did prior to this update is I got a lot of them. I didn't reroll any of them. I just recently rerolled this one to make it a little bit stronger because I wanted one with armor on it anyway. But I definitely wanted to like kind of like see what was going on with this. So I kept a bunch of these didn't roll because I wasn't sure what was going to happen. So I have one that has weapon damage, headshot damage, weapon damage, crit chance. We have this one that has crit chance, weapon damage, armor. But what I want to do is be able to roll that core attribute. So I was excited because I was like, man, maybe I could have two 15% weapon damage rolls on one piece. So I go over to the recalibration station thinking that this was going to work. I go down to this one and I click on armor and look what happens. Armor and skill tier are the only two things you could roll there. And I was like, well, maybe there's a bug in the game, period. So I went over and I was like, let me check something else that I have that I haven't rolled, um, that I might have rolled armor on. Um, right here. No, that's, I'm trying to pick one that I haven't rolled yet, that I have rolled arm Right here. So we have this Yao piece right here. So if I were to click on this, you can notice that we already have weapon damage, armor, skill tier. But let's see if we have one right here. We have this one that has armor. And then you notice we have weapon damage and skill tier. So yeah, you're supposed to be able to roll weapon damage on there. You should be able to see this weapon damage and skill tier, but I am not seeing that. Yes, I am not seeing that at all. And then I went back and I was like, hold on, let me go back to my piece and then double check just to make sure. And yep, you can't, right? You can max it out. You can put skill tier, but you can't put weapon damage on there, which you should be able to. And then I was thinking, well, maybe this is how they wanted it to work. Maybe this is how they want this new named holster to be. Maybe they don't want it to be that powerful, but didn't really make any sense because it's not like the, the main piece of this is you get that 15% weapon damage as an attribute and you lose an attribute, right? And then someone asked the question on Twitter and this is what was answered by one of our community developers. Um, they said, definitely not intended behavior. We are looking into it. So they are looking into this. You should be able to roll this core attribute two weapon damage so just remember you'll have weapon damage crit chance and then you'll be able to roll ideally what i would tell you guys if you guys start farming for this i wouldn't roll anything else on this i, I would just get a bunch like what, what you saw what i did is i have a bunch if we go to my stash right not my stash but to my inventory i have quite a few of them and i have a couple more in my stash so i would recommend don't roll anything at the moment you should be able to roll that core attribute in the future. So what I would do is look for items that have crit chance, crit damage, well, sorry, have a crit chance or headshot damage or crit damage or the rolls you want and then leave the top roll and then wait until we're able to roll that because that's going to be a big piece on a lot of your builds, especially being able to have 15% weapon damage as an attribute and 15% damage as a core attribute. It's kind of cool. It's cool enough just that you could do it like this. But yeah, they, we should have the option to run red there or blue. Just just my my opinion. And and they said they're looking into it. So yeah, anybody who's wor worried about this new holster, yes, you will be able to roll it. <laughs> just not in 16.1. We're going to have to wait a little bit. And 16.2 will probably be when this is available, I'm assuming. But that's how it goes, guys. Seems like we, we constantly have issues, but hopefully... They, they get taken care of, but that's it. If you guys are wondering about this holster, a lot of you guys might actually search this, see what's going on with it. Well, that is the issue right now. It should be fixed in the future. All right, we're gonna wrap it up here. Appreciate the support, appreciate the love. See you in the next one. Hey, nothing but skills out.